Los Obispo City Council plans to respond to a grand jury report on the city's management of wildfire risk. KSBY News reporter Asia Gore joins us live in San Luis Obispo with more on the findings of that report and how city leaders intend to respond. Asia, fire season is really year round these days. How are they doing it? Absolutely, Dustin. Good morning. Uh, when it comes to that report, the grand jury report issued back in June, the city of San Luis Obispo received two recommendations for mitigating its risks of wildfire. But the chief of the fire department here says they're already working to get those recommendations into place. The grand jury recommends a countywide weed abatement ordinance and program, public outreach and education, and improvements to the existing alert system. The report claims the city of San Luis Obispo underutilizes its reverse 911 system to alert residents of danger. And the grand jury also recommending the city of San Luis Obispo develop a chipping program to eliminate fire fuels. So we have identified uh, several areas in the community that could be challenging in the event of evacuation uh, during a wildfire. Uh, some areas up in uh, Bishop's Peak and, as well as uh, Irish Hills uh, and in the Johnson area could be challenging if we had a large wildfire with a lot of heavy smoke that could uh, block the visibility of pe those people that are trying to evacuate. According to the grand jury report, information about the city's evacuation plan is not readily available to the public and could create confusion for residents if disaster strikes. Agson says his department is working on improvements to the evacuation plan. And though the report finds only 30,000 people are connected to the county's reverse 911 system, Agson believes it is effective. And Exxon says his department is already following the city's community wildfire protection plan, which was just finalized about two weeks ago. Live in San Luis Obispo, I'm Asia Gore, KSBY News. Good to see that they're investing in that. Thank you very much, Asia. And the city's response will either be to approve or deny this issue at Tuesday's city council meeting.